you want to obviously have your arms around your client. You want them to have as much of their uh, share of wallet uh, you know, with your firm. But the reality is most people are going to deal with multiple firms. And if you can add value to them in that simple example of allowing them to have that information in your vault with your brand, which you don't have any access to, by the way, other than the information that you share with them, but they can permission in. One of the patents we have is our permissioning technology. They can permission in a banker if they're trying to get a mortgage to see statements. They can permission in a life insurance agent. They can permission an accountant, et cetera, et cetera. In this case, what was fascinating was, and this is where the world's going, the fund administrator on behalf of the hedge fund was permissioned in our vault. Now, you've probably never heard of us, anybody in this room. They've never heard of us. But they took it at face value, and someday, hopefully, a lot of people have heard of us, and then it will be really taken at face value as a standard. But it was quite interesting. So you can see on our audit trail, uh, it was Firmidium, Firmidium out of uh, New York, a fund right. administrator that went into that part of my vault, and we saw what time they looked at it and downloaded it. That's the future of how things are going to change using the digital vault construct. Thank you.